hello my dear students so welcome back to my channel hope you are all doing well so in this video i will be discussing uh, the vector calculus module first for the triple e students uh, the subject code is bmat e201 okay second semester mathematics so here specifically i will explain uh, this particular variety that is a normal vector okay later on we will solve the varieties of problems whatever it may be so find a unit normal vector to the surface x square y plus 2 x z is equal to 4 at these particular points 2 comma minus 2 comma 3 okay so this equation this surface is denoted by phi okay it is a scalar quantity but we are dealing here with the vectors okay so whenever we are combining del operator with phi okay this del phi this is this becomes your vector quantity okay so we are dealing with these uh, vector quantities over here okay so phi is given what we have to calculate unit normal vector so we have a formula for the normal vector this is your unit normal vector which is equal to delta phi divided by mod of delta phi okay so del, del of phi is your vector quantity now see del phi we have the formula it is given by dou phi by dou x plus dou phi by dou phi by dou y plus dou phi by dou z okay we are differentiating this phi with respect to x with respect to y with respect to z okay these are the unit vectors i cap j cap and k cap okay this is the formula for del phi okay first of all we will calculate this one then later on we will calculate magnitude so that we will get answer for the unit normal vector okay so del phi is equal to dou by dou x of what is the phi value it is given x square y plus 2 x z minus 4 so i am writing here x square y plus 2 x z minus 4 i cap plus dou by dou y of phi same value you have to put down here right j cap plus dou by dou z of phi so phi is here it is the same value so x square y plus 2 x z minus 4 k cap okay i hope up to this it is clear now let me differentiate this equation so del phi is equal to you are respecting sorry you are differentiating this term with respect to x so x is present here so what is the differentiation of x square so it is 2x okay so how you are uh, differentiating the term you see here if it is x square so it will become 2x raised power 2 minus 1 power down and minus 1 so that will become your 2x 2 minus 1 is 1 so 2 into x raised power 1 is 2x so that is why i am writing here the differentiation of x square is 2x and y is constant with respect to x so y you just keep it as it is right so it is differentiation will become 2xy plus here x is present so what is the differentiation of x uh, 2 is here also 2 is constant with respect to x so just keep it as it is so differentiation of x with respect to x is 1 so no need to write 2 ones are 2 and z is here it is constant with respect to x so 2z will be the differentiation right so and i cap is as it is plus now x square y so x square is a uh, constant with respect to y so keep it as it is and y differentiation of y with respect to y is 1 so x square multiplied by 1 is x square okay and here x z and 2 so y term is not present here we are differentiating with respect to y okay so it is differentiation will be 0 plus 4 is all already a constant uh, so it is differentiation with respect to y will be 0 and j cap plus so here see here x square y but we are differenti uh, differentiating with respect to z so z term is absent it is differentiation will be 0 plus z is present here so what is the differentiation of z with respect to z 1 so 2x is constant with respect to z so keep it as it is 2x multiplied by differentiation of uh, z is 1 so 2x into 1 is 2x minus 4 is constant we cannot differentiate it with respect to z so its differentiation will be 0 k cap right so del phi is equal to 2xy plus 2z i cap plus x square j cap plus 2x k cap okay now we are giving uh, we are having uh, the points over here that is 2 minus 2 3 these are the points given so i can write down del phi 2 comma minus 2 comma 3 which is equal to you have to put down the x value as 2 y value as minus 2 and z value as 3 over here right so 2 multiplied by x value is 2 y value is minus 2 2 into 2 into minus 2 plus 2 into z z value is 3 2 into 3 j cap plus x square value 2 square j cap plus 2 into x x value is 2 2 into 2 k cap okay now del phi is equal to 2 into 2 into 2 it is minus 8 plus 6 so that will be your minus 2 j sorry 2 i cap plus 2 square is 4 j cap plus 2 twos are 4 that is your 4 k cap right so then mod of del phi which we need uh, in the formula so we have to calculate the uh, mod of del phi so del phi is equal to under root of what are the coefficients are with the unit vectors you have to take the squares of that particular coefficients so minus 2 square plus 4 square plus 4 square this will be your magnitude for del phi so which is equal to when you just sum up these terms 2 twos are 4 plus 
फोर फोर जार सिक्सटीन फोर फोर जार सिक्सटीन सिक्सटीन प्लस सिक्सटीन थर्टी टू थर्टी टू प्लस थर्टी सॉरी फोर इज इक्वल टू थर्टी सिक्स सो रूट ऑफ थर्टी सिक्स इज इक्वल टू सिक्स ओके नाउ वी हैव टू कैलकुलेट नॉर्मल यूनिट वैक्टर ओके यूनिट नॉर्मल वैक्टर विच इज गिवन बाई एन कैप इज इक्वल टू डेल फाइव डिवाइड बाई मॉड ऑफ डेल फाइव सो डेल फाइव वे हैव कैलकुलेटेड टू आई कैप प्लस फोर जे कैप प्लस फोर के कैप ओके डिवाइडेड बाई मॉड ऑफ डेल फाइव मॉड ऑफ डेल फाइव इज सिक्स So divided by six. Now you can separately divide this six to each and every term. So min minus two i divided by six plus four j cap divided by six plus four k cap divided by six. So two ones, two threes. So you will get minus i by three plus two twos are four, two threes are six. Two by three you will get here. Two I, again, two by three. Yeah, here we get. Okay. So uh, you can take uh, three in the denominator, and here we will left with minus i plus two j plus two k. Okay. I hope uh, you have got this particular solution. How we are supposed to calculate uh, the unit normal unit normal vector? This is a very simple procedure over here. Only thing is you need to remember the formula. We are differentiating the phi with respect to x, with respect to y, with respect to z. Then we are calculating the magnitude. Later on, we are simply uh, putting down these values that are we have got uh, here. So we are putting down in this particular equation. You will get the Unit normal vector. Okay, this is six or seven marks. These are just in your pocket. If you just practice three or more uh, more problems on this concept, you will get the clarity how to solve these problems. I hope this much content uh, you have understood very well. So make sure you will share this video to all your friends who actually need it, and uh, all the best for your future examinations. Thank you.